an international consortium including the Institute of Transport and Logistics Studies at the University of Sydney is to continue its groundbreaking efforts to improve bus rapid transit systems with renewed backing from the Volvo Research and Education Foundation. Professor Corin Mully from the Institute describes their approach. We've been looking at all sorts of things as a consortium about how bus rapid transit could be better placed in cities and provide better mobility for citizens, because that's what it's all about. More recently, we've been looking at another stated choice experiment to try and dig down and find out what sort of characteristics are putting people in favour of rail-based technology rather than road-based technology. And there's some interesting features that have come out of this. And the two that stand out for me is that Actually, from buses, what citizens appreciate is the greater network that you get for the same amount of dollars spent. So we gave people a fixed budget. You know, you can have this amount of network from this one or this amount of network from another without saying that it was LRT or BRT. And people chose that feature as being important to them. And the second thing which stood out for me in terms of the research is the role of experience. So in cities like Brisbane, where people are familiar with bus rapid transit, it gets a very much higher rating in terms of people being prepared to vote for a system that would include BRT.